Go, hey. Liz. Lucky. Hey. How's your summer been going so far? Okay. Come on back. Good. Uh, you know, Liz, uh, that last time that we... Well, the time that we tried to discuss about your English final, I, uh, called you. But I never heard anything back. Oh, right. Yeah, I got those messages. I must have just completely forgot about it. Remember I told you that Mr. Marty was nice enough to give me advice on what to do in, in case I burned out on the test? Mm-hmm. Well, that night, um, I got really sick because, you know, I knew how I did and I was right. Hmm. Sorry about your grade. Oh, it's not your fault. So do you have a plan? Well, Lucky and I were just discussing it, and the only thing I can think of is summer school. They won't be offering that class this summer. I thought they were. Uh -uh. We had a meeting last week, and they decided it wasn't cost effective. So what does she do? Well, I'm going to be going on vacation for a couple of weeks, but when I get back, I'd be glad to give you some private tutoring. No way. With all due respect, I know you're Liz's friend, but you're way out of line. I'm out of line. Lucky. This is really none of your business. In fact, I'm starting to wonder if you're not part of Liz's problem. Well, that's rich coming from me. Lucky, it's not Mr. Murray's fault that I didn't study hard enough. Look, I'd love to have the whole summer off. But if you don't address this, you're going to be repeating a class next year. And you cannot get your diploma without a pass. But, you know, it's your life. No one's forcing you. So, you think private tutoring is the way to go? I really don't see any other option. But take a week or two and see if you can come up with one. If not, you can leave a message on my machine. You have my number? Yeah. Great. When I get back from vacation, we'll set something up together. Good night. Thanks. Are you out of your mind? Tell me you see what Murray's trying to do. He's setting you up. Elizabeth, if you go to that private tutor and he'll try for you again. But isn't that what we want? Not after what it did to you when we tried setting a trap for him in the park. You freaked. You told me you were paralyzed. You felt like you were going to faint. The, the idea isn't conducive to your mental health, Elizabeth. But I'm not going to sit at home and do nothing. Except feeling like my life is out of control. Are you saying that... If, if I do this tutoring, you're not going to be there to back me up? If you're that crazy, of course I'll be there. But I'm not saying I'm going to be happy about it. Good. Because I'm beginning to think that getting Murdy off the street is the only way I'm going to get well. <laughs>